The poet Byrne Williams once said, there is no psychiatrist in the world like a puppy licking your face. Marine Lance Corporal Daniel Carter was stationed in Afghanistan in February of 2010. Carter was severely wounded in combat, and almost two years later, he still has medical complications, which also include symptoms of post-traumatic stress disorder, which is commonly called PTSD. PTSD is a mental health condition triggered by a terrifying experience. Some of the symptoms associated with it are uh, nightmares, uh, severe anxiety, flashbacks, and these can also be accompanied um, by thoughts of the actual event itself that are uncontrollable. Carter is one of the few Hawaii-based Marines who received 100% disability due to his injuries. Um, I was shot once in the chest and I was blown up three different times. Some of his physical injuries included gunshot and shrapnel wounds, nerve damage, broken ribs, and internal bleeding. And when I came back to the I was forced into going into the Wounded Warrior program, and once there, the docs never released me. Susan Lores of Hawaii Fido trains puppies to become certified companion service dogs for the soldiers in the Wounded Warriors program. But oftentimes they need a dog that does more than calm them down and help with the anxiety. Uh, the Wounded Warrior dogs are trained just like the regular service dogs. It's a two-year training program. They do lots of training skills, and then they're matched with an individual who also gets trained. Finn is a um, unique dog. Um, he takes care of me when I'm in a lot of pain and I can't, I can't get out of bed. He'll, uh, he'll get my medication for me. He'll, um, he'll get on the bed and comfort me. If, when I'm having bad dreams at night, he'll wake, he'll wake me up so I don't have to experience it. Uh, we have found the results of this program that definitely reduces anxiety, helps with the night dreams, night terrors, gets them out of their homes, uh, interacting with society, and overall just kind of keeps them calmed down. I see a, a huge difference. Um, I'm a lot more active. Uh, I, I talk to people a lot more. Um, I'm doing this interview right now so, <laughs> with Finn in my life. I've stopped, I've quit drinking, um, I've quit smoking, I'm not as angry, um, a lot, I think I'm a lot more happy of a person. Carter, along with Finn, has recently left to California to pursue his dreams of attending college and becoming a counselor for soldiers in the Wounded Warriors program. This is Wailua High School reporting for Hiki No.